Whether you're building a residential haven or a commercial masterpiece, knowing your sheet materials is a builder's secret weapon. In this video, I'll explain how and when to use either plywood, MDF, OSB or chipboard as the best sheet material and much more. First up we have plywood. Plywood is a fantastic all-rounder in construction. It's made by bonding layers of wood veneers together, creating a strong and durable sheet material. In residential buildings, plywood shines as flooring subfloors, wall sheathing, and roof decking. Its versatility means it's great for both interior and exterior use. In commercial projects, plywood finds its way into concrete formwork, temporary hoardings and even furniture. Its ability to handle heavy loads makes it an excellent choice. The benefits of plywood include its strength, affordability and resistance to warping. It comes in various grades, so choose the right one for your specific needs. Next on our list is orientated strand board, commonly known as OSB. OSB is similar to plywood, but instead of veneers, it's made by compressing wood strands and adhesive together. Residentially, OSB is a hit as roof sheathing, wall panels and subflooring. Its consistent composition means it's less likely to have voids. Commercially, OSB is perfect for shop fitting, packaging and temporary structures. It's efficient and cost effective. OSB's benefits include excellent structural integrity, moisture resistance and eco-friendliness. Just like plywood, different grades cater to different projects. Now let's talk about medium density fiberboard or MDF. Unlike the previous two, MDF is engineered from wood fibers and resin resulting in a smooth and uniform surface. Residentially, MDF is a go-to for interior trim, cabinets and decorative panels. Its smooth finish makes it perfect for painting and veneering. Commercially, MDF works well for retail fixtures, office furniture and exhibition stands. Its consistent density ensures reliable results. MDF boasts a sleek surface, making it ideal for intricate designs. It's cost-effective, easy to work with and minimizes splintering. Last but not least, let's talk about chipboard, also known as particle board. Chipboard is created by compressing wood chips and resin under high pressure. Residentially, chipboard often finds its place as underlayment for flooring, cabinets and shelving. It's budget friendly and it gets the job done. Commercially, chipboard is used for temporary structures, modular furniture and packaging. Its affordability is a significant advantage. Chipboard's key advantages include its low cost, easy availability and consistent density. Keep in mind that its strength and durability might not match that of plywood or OSB. Whether you're building a residential haven or a commercial masterpiece, knowing your sheet materials is a builder's secret weapon. Each of the four types of sheet materials have their unique strengths and applications as we've explored. So now you can be sure of picking the right one for you and your project. Learn more about other timber and sheet materials by watching one of these videos. And remember, to subscribe and hit that notification bell to know when we upload more construction tips and tricks. Until next time, happy building.